We recently reported that a London-based company, AOG Technics, had allegedly provided uncertified parts for the repair of aircraft engines used in many older-generation Airbus and Boeing jets. Reacting to the news, airlines have been hard at work identifying if their aircraft have been affected by the scandal. Well, United Airlines revealed on September 18th that it had discovered fake parts in two of its aircraft engines. This is in addition to two other major airlines having discovered the same, Southwest Airlines and Virgin Australia. Let's look at this developing situation for today's video. United Airlines announced that it had found the faulty parts in engines on two separate aircraft. The carrier also said that it would replace the engines before returning the planes to service. United, however, did not specify which type of aircraft the engines were installed on, although the parts were noted to be seals on compressor stator vanes. These function to help direct airflow throughout the engine. As already noted, the identified supplier of the uncertified parts is AOG Technics Limited. These specific AOG parts are spares that are utilized on older generation engines from CFM International Incorporated, known as the CFM 56 engine, an engine that powers older generation Airbus A320s and Boeing 737s. Aviation regulators have said that AOG knowingly supplied spare engine parts that were backed by falsified documentation. AOG has supplied CFM with 50 different part numbers on the CFM 56 engine. CFM has said that the parts have been used in 68 of its power plants worldwide. A spokesperson told Bloomberg in a statement that it was taking aggressive legal action against AOG. CFM is taking legal action to uncover more documentation that may lead to the engine supplier assisting airlines with the search for faulty engine parts. Additionally, European regulators have said that the faulty parts are a matter of concern, but there have been no reports of problems directly caused by the parts. After the supplier discovered that AOG had supplied fraudulent parts, it immediately notified all airlines that were operating aircraft that may be affected. Virgin Australia has also announced that it would temporarily ground two aircraft after it found parts supplied by AOG. The Australian carrier confirmed that the affected aircraft were Boeing 737-800s, typically used for domestic routes throughout Australia. One of the affected parts is a seal on a high-pressure turbine nozzle. Additionally, the airline had discovered a low-pressure turbine blade on one of the 737s had also been supplied by AOG. A spokesperson for Virgin said in a statement, We apply a highly stringent approach to maintenance to ensure our safety standard is upheld. The first airline to discover AOG Technics parts on its aircraft was Southwest. On September 8th, the Dallas-based airline announced it had pulled a pair of low-pressure turbine blades from one of its Boeing 737 NGs. What do you think of this whole ordeal? Let us know by leaving a comment. In addition to our daily YouTube videos, Simple Flying publishes over 150 articles every week. If you're looking for the latest aviation news and insights, visit simpleflying.com.